How many persons am I? If I got the spirit and I got a soul and I got a mind, how many persons am I? You're, you're one because no, no. How many persons? So I'm one. Know your name. One person. Yeah. You would know. You would know exactly. Yeah. I am one person, right? Three entities. I'm one person. Yeah. How many persons are there in the in the Godhead? You are three in one. You're, 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 I'm still one person. Doesn't matter what you have. You said I'm still one person. How many persons? How many persons are in the Godhead? No, no. If you look at the Godhead, it's got three persons. Whereas I'm still one person, you see? Doesn't matter whether you call okay, me you uh, flesh or spirit or, or whatever it is. I'm still one person, my friend. Okay, what you think, yeah, what you think is different to your body, which is different to your spirit. You mean but my soul? You mean my soul? But you're still one. Yeah, I never said I was... So, what did so I just say? I'm one person. Did I not say that, guys? In the same way you're made in the image of God. That's, yeah, that's in the yeah, likeness yeah. of God. No, no, no. For you, image of God, maybe you think... Do you think you look like the Father? Do I look like the father? Yes. Well, I look, I look like the son. No, wait, because wait, wait. So why not? Wait, wait, wait. If they all are same, why don't I you look like the father? You could say that I'm made in the likeness of God. Yes. So I'm made in no, the No, no. Why not in the, the image father, of the I'm father? I'm asking you. Why not in the image of the? If you believe that there is only one God, why are you not in the image of the father? I am in the image of the father. But I earlier asked you. You said you look in the image of the son. Okay. You see what I mean? You, you can't have it okay. both ways. My question originally was: Give your take on what Matthew four says. What does Matthew four say? Read it to me. Uh, I'll read it. I'll read it. Sorry to interrupt. Because I, I don't like to have two, two conversations with two different people. Yes? Do you want to carry on with the early? I don't mind doing that. Because this yeah. gentleman, I think he'll have to wait because you were here no, first. No, of course. It's yeah. only fair. I, I want to stand on my point there. Yeah. Okay. Your point was what? What was so your point? point? So we have your point was that Jesus was God. Yeah. I showed you from the Bible yeah. why Jesus show, never yeah. claimed he's to like, be God. He has the hierarchy, you mean? So he's the Father, the Son, and after, you know, the, it looks like it's a kind of hierarchy when Jesus also prays, yeah? Prays to the Father. Yeah, he always prays he's and worships trinity, the Father. Of course, yeah. because he's a trinity. Well, but what? the Father never prays to the Son. Okay. Because or never the worships the Son. The Father is the, because Jesus is on the visible side that we can see him. So the Father, we don't see him. No, I'm yeah. saying even after his ascension, remember? Yeah. First Corinthians 11, 3, yeah. did you, that, that, that's did you check I'm it? Yeah, that's yeah check it. Out. Even after his ascension, it says the head of Christ yeah, is God. Is, yeah. Okay, so what Matthew 4 says yeah. is... Uh, the head, head of Christ, Christ is God. So yeah. Is that, yeah. Head yeah. of Christ means the, yeah. the leader or the boss. Just like the head of the state is a president, yes, yeah. or the prime minister, yes. Jesus has a head over him. That means he has someone who commands him what to do, when to do, what to say even. You know, even the, even the Holy Spirit is commanded what to say. John 16, yes? He will only say what he hears. From whom? From the Father again. So you see How the... Who is sending? Who is going to send? Again, the again is the Father. Who is sending? Hold again on, the Father. Hold on. Hold on. So the Father is the you? one sending them, telling them what to do. Because Jesus send. is speaking, I will, yeah? I will send you. Yes. And he's going to hear, you're going to hear on my name. He's specify his name. No, no, name. read John 16. Don't make okay. up your own no, things. No, 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 no. In no, my no. name. Show me why he says that. In my name. Yes, okay. Go 16, read John, John 16, 14. Yeah. To... Sorry, you were saying what? Sorry, sorry. Um, I just want to hear your take on what No, tell me Matthew 4. What does it say? The, the part that you all want to. Take him up into a holy city and sit with him on a pinnacle of the temple and say unto him, If thou be the Son of God, cast thyself down. For it is written, a nice pass. He shall it's give everything his I can angels see. charge concerning thee, and in their hands they no, shall bear the thee up, lest at any time thou dash a foot thy foot against a stone. Exactly Jesus said unto him, it is, written, written, again, him, it is written, written again, Thou shalt not tempt the Lord thy God. Mm. So God is mine and God here, the mm. was, declare it to you. Is is mine. Temp tempting him, yeah. Jesus. And who is Jesus the, the claiming to be? In that according to that, it says the Son of God, yeah? What does it say, the Son of Man or Son of God? It says, it, says, it yeah, is written well, again, is, uh, thou shalt not the tempt the Lord thy God. No, no, before that, what, what does it say? The Son of Man or Son of God? At the beginning of the passage you read. Yeah, there you go. Jesus, that, that's the best description of Jesus the of to describe. Exactly. So Jesus, if... Jesus, wait, wait, wait. Let's analyze that. It is written, yeah. yeah, I agree. I agree. So let's... Let's, 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 let's uh, analyze what he just said there. First and foremost, do you, do you believe what the Bible said about Jesus? Do I believe... What the Bible? Because the Bible is speaking there, right? Okay, do you believe what he's saying that about... Jesus. No, no, not that. Not only the fact that he's tempting. He said something that if you throw do yourself down from the pinnacle, the angels will save you. Do you believe that bit? I, I believe that that would happen if. No, no. Remember, the devil is saying this. Yeah. And what does the devil say? The devil says it is written. Where is it written? Well, Jesus can do anything that he wants to do. My friend, you're not even paying attention to what I'm asking. Did the 
Bible say that it is written? Where is it written? In the Psalms. Well, if in the book of Psalms. I mean, because there's, there's, if you look in the Old Testament, I don't know the scripture. You're the one who brought this up, Matthew 4. Yeah. You don't know what the context. I'm saying, what I'm saying is, all I'm asking is, who is Jesus claiming to be? No, you know what you're That's doing? What I'm asking. You are divorcing the passage from his context. There's an, entire, there's an entire context to this, which, you're, which you are, see, it seems like you're not familiar with. No, so let me, let me tell you what the, okay, okay let me tell you, no, 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 you, you quoted that. My question, my question is, is a question what always has context. To be in that passage, hold on, hold on. It. Jesus says, do not tempt. Again, he's saying it is written. Yeah. Yes, Jesus written where? No. Say that, yeah. no, no, no. Read the passage. Okay, Jesus, Jesus says, that, yeah. for it is written, yeah. thou shalt not tempt thy God. Yeah. Where is it written? God. Yes, where is it written? Because you, well, you didn't have the New I Testament the then. I don't know the they didn't have Matthew. If Jesus in... is saying that it is written, then I believe that it is written. No, no, but you see, would... you see, hold on, hold on. For me, what do you need me, to right? do? Wait, wait. You, you probably know scripture better than I do. It's not about knowing better. It's to know the context. Do you realize that Matthew... The Gospel of Matthew wasn't present during the time of Jesus. Do you know this? Okay. Okay? If the Gospel wasn't present, then Jesus, when he says this is written, he's obviously asking it, sorry, he's, he's, he's referring to something is written prior to Matthew's Gospel. Yes? Okay. Like in the Old Testament. Yes? It could be the Psalm, it could be some other passage. The point is that Jesus is pointing you to, an, to the Old Testament prophecy that if the Messiah, if the Messiah throws himself down, yes? then the angels will save him. Okay. Now Jesus is now put to test by whom? By the devil. So that, that wants to test him that if you are indeed who you claim to be, the son of God, then if you throw yourself down from this pinnacle, yes, from, from a, I don't know, a synagogue church, uh, or sorry, tower or something, a high temple or a tower, yes, then the prophecy which is in the Old Testament will come true. But Jesus doesn't go through with that test because he felt that the, he doesn't go through it. No, so he doesn't throw himself down and prove to the look the angel saved me and I'm really the Messiah. But that wasn't spoken. That wasn't spoken of in the Old Testament. That wasn't spoken how do you know that? How do you know that? Well, how do you know? How do you so know what is? So what does the Bible mean when he says, "Is it not written? It's written where?" Well, you tell me. <laughs> it means you don't know. So, so instead of you making, so instead of you making the claim, instead of, do you mind? Asif, stop it. Instead of you making the claim that I don't know, yes, the fact is you don't know what's written in the Old Testament. What I do know, what I do know yeah. is that in that passage, Jesus is calling himself God. No, he didn't. Where did he say he was God? Okay, I'll read it again. <laughs> yeah, go on, read it again. I'll read it again. Remember, he said he called himself God. Let's see that. Okay. Go on.